All right, hey there. So I am going to go over how to swap out um, my switches and I'll also do a video on how to swap out the motors for my turners. As you can see, this is a huge 10 cup turner. And honestly, sometimes switches and motors do go bad. So um, I've spent a couple years designing my turners so that they're very um, easily fixed by the owner instead of, you know, either losing an arm or having to ship it back and me fix it. So this is going to be a very, very easy fix. Um, all you're going to need, um, any kind of wire strippers will do. Um, any kind of wire, um, sorry, electrical tape will do just fine. If you know how to shrink wrap, um, heat shrink wrap, you can do that, but this will get you through in a fix. And then just a knife or a little screwdriver. Now, as far as the switches go, they just prop, wrap, pop right out. And all you're going to do, you can either use your knife. I like to use wire cutters. There we go. We're going to set that to the side. That's your bad, um, your bad switch. And then we're just going to strip a little bit of these wires. You know, I don't know, half inch, quarter inch. What I like to do, I like to twist them. That way they're ready to go. And guess what? I don't have my new switch here. Give me one minute. <laughs> All right, here we go. Um, then of course, I can tell you where to get all the switches and motors. They're very inexpensive. Um, I've, I very, very rarely have problems with them. So as you saw, just cut, strip, twist, and then just black to black. Oh, and guess what, everyone? I'm doing this with it plugged in. I haven't gotten shocked yet, but that's probably only a matter of time. <laughs> Let's unplug it. <laughs> so there we go. And then you're just going to twist, 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 twist. Um, yeah. I tried making another video and <laughs> I ran out of battery. So the video didn't take. So I'm doing this once again. And as you can see, I make these so that there's plenty of room to work. There's plenty of wire in, in here. It's all covered up. You can get to the wiring on the inside if you like, but it's just as easy to do this. And you're done. You just fixed your switch right here. Probably under, what, two minutes? Super, super easy. And just wrap it up really good. And like I said, if you know how to do um, heat shrink, you know, that's, that's another option. But this will get you through just fine. Feed the wires through. And it, um... A little friction grab into there just press it in nice and easy and you're done that is how to fix a bad switch thank you for watching and i'm going to do a video on how to do the motors next thank you bye bye